Hey guys, I'm Joy Renee for Poker Central. I'm joined by Ben Lamb, who was on the final table last year. So you know exactly what these guys are going through. And now you have a friend up there. Talk to me about what you told him, what advice you gave him. Uh, so Johnson, yeah. uh, I play with him in LA and Bahamas, a couple other places. Uh, great guy, good at poker, very good at poker. A lot of fun to you know hang out with and have a good time with. Uh, you know, I just kind of told him that some of the people there are going to be waiting to implode. A lot of people are going to be playing way too tight, and you know you're going to find out who's doing what. You know, in the first hour or two, and then kind of adjust your strategy based on that. What do you think about them not having a break this year? Last year, you guys got two days off, take some time to regroup. How do you think that affects things? Uh, everyone at that final table is extremely tired. Like during those two days, I slept. 20 hours a day or 15 wow. hours a day or whatever. I was just, you're just so tired after eight days of, of playing every day, 12 hours a day, watching every hand, even when you're not in hands. Uh, so that's pretty crazy that they don't have a break at all because they have to be just so exhausted mentally. Yeah. And then last night, that epic final bust out hand, did you watch that and what were you thinking? I was playing the 10K6 Max and uh, we knew someone at Aces, someone at Kings, someone at Kings, which is like ridiculous in itself. So and, crazy. And to be at the 10 handed final table, the main events like insane like, really really insane uh yeah i mean crazy crazy yeah yeah it was crazy last night joe cotta made the second final table again and yeah. then phil helmuth's 15th bracelet what are your thoughts on that <laughs> you know uh <laughs> helmuth's supposed to be doing something right you know a lot of people give him give him a lot of crap or whatever and uh you know the guy's 15 bracelets next guy's got 10. Uh, he's doing something right you know okay uh, he might be doing some things wrong but he's doing a lot of things right so he deserves the credit he uh, he deserves, you know, for having 15 bracelets and, and Joe Cotta making the final table again, again after winning it. You know, it's it's it's, it's pretty crazy. Anyone bracelet this summer as well, so yeah, pretty exciting stuff. And what do you think about the events being right after the main event? Do you think it changes the excitement of the main event? Uh, no, I don't think it makes too much change. Uh, I think it's the same. I think the same people are going to stay and play these events, the 10K and the 50K. Uh, are you playing with both those? I bust the 10K today. It's a nice needle. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, I will be playing the 50K. But you have the 50K. Yeah, I'll play it. Yeah, for sure. All right. Well, good luck to you, and thanks for being with us on the 411. Thank you. I'm Drea Renee. This is Ben Lamb, and that's the 411.